Welcome to another video from Excel and CAT. My name is Ajay Anand. In this video, I will show you how to insert PDF files or Word documents into an Excel workbook. Before I open this Excel workbook, take a look at the size of this file, 8 KB. Let me open this workbook. To insert a PDF file into this workbook, select a cell in the portion where you want to insert the file. Go to the Insert tab, Text, Object, Create from File, Browse. Using this dialog called Browse, select the file which you want to insert. We'll select this PDF file called Sales Report. Insert, Display as icon. When I click OK, the selected PDF file got inserted into this workbook. You can reposition this file if you want to. Now to open this PDF file, either double click on this object or right click Acrobat document object, open. See the PDF file got opened. Using the same method, we can insert Word documents, text files, PowerPoint presentations and different kinds of files into an Excel workbook. So once again, to insert a Word document, in the Insert tab, Text, Object, Create from File, Browse, we'll select this Word document, Insert, Display as Icon, OK. Now to open this Word document, double click on it. Note that we are not creating links to the files on this computer, but we are embedding files into this workbook. In other words, these files will get saved inside this workbook. Let me show you what I mean. Right now the size of this workbook is 8 KB. But when I save this workbook, File, Save. See the size of the workbook got modified according to the size of the embedded files. And one more thing to note, these objects are independent of the cells behind them. So when I hide the columns or rows behind these objects, it won't affect the position of these objects. But if you want these objects to resize with the columns and rows behind them, let me show you how to do that. First of all, I will place this object into a cell. Right click on the object, Format Object, Properties, Move and Size with the Cells, OK. Now when I resize this column, see the object also got resized. Height, see the object got hidden with the column. Right click, Format Object, Properties, Move and Size with the Cells, OK, Height, the objects got hidden with the row. I really hope you got something new from this video. If you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing to the channel so that you won't miss any future video releases. Thanks for watching, wish you a great day.